See how fast the Earth can spin before it gets destroyed. All right, the Earth currently spins at around 0.4 kilometers per second at the equator. Let's change that to one kilometer per second and see what happens. Even with a slight increase, the water at the poles starts flowing to the equator. The sea level at the equator starts to increase rapidly in places like Africa, and the Amazon rainforest starts to get flooded. Japan gets connected with mainland Asia, and we can also see some evidence of flooding in Australia. Now let's change the speed to four kilometers per second. At this speed, water starts to exist only at the equator as a narrow band. The North and South Poles are completely dry and life over there becomes almost impossible. The people around the equator at this time would start to experience 25% less gravity due to the centrifugal force of the rotation. Okay, now let's change the speed to 10 kilometers per second. The Earth is now spinning so fast that it starts tearing itself apart and small pieces of the planet start flying off into space. Some of them fall back down, causing the Earth to heat up and turn into an inferno. Life would no longer be possible on the planet. Finally, at 40 kilometers per second, the Earth completely destroys itself, tearing itself apart and flinging its outer layers into space. The only thing that would remain is the glowing hot core of our planet.